Insane. This is my little brother Tom. Several months ago, Tom came up to me saying he wanted to start hitting the gym. He wanted to get into better shape and become healthier. However, there was one small problem with this. So what's the deal with Tom and weightlifting? Tom's not allowed to lift any weights till he's 14 because I'm too scared and he'll hurt himself. At the moment, my mum thought he was too young to start. So several months rolled by and finally on the 19th of December, Tom turned 14 years old. And that was the day we thought it would all start. Are you ready to start this transformation? I am ready, yes. But then another problem hit. Ah, I can't. Oh, jeez. He had pretty bad form. Now, there was nothing wrong with this at all. Tombola had just started, it was expected. But instead of going straight into weightlifting, for the next few months, we decided to just fully focus on perfecting his form. And that brings us to the first day of the transformation. Okay, so we're joined with the big man who's going to absolutely become a beast yeah started like getting into the idea of wanting to go to the gym and like get stronger what are your goals for this lose weight get less chubby uh get stronger yeah. and put on muscle let's do it i think we, i think we can do that yeah Let's go over Tom's workout program. Now, his two goals in the gym were to get stronger and build more muscle. So I got to work. I created a three day a week full body split which focused on strength and hypertrophy. And it was gonna get Tom strong as fuck. Bench, pull ups, incline bench, dumbbell rows, and then tricep and bicep exercises. And making sure to constantly apply progressive overload. So how did you like find the workouts? Uh, not easy. <laughs> yes. There you go, there you go. Feel it in the back, yes, Tom. <laughs> Muscles are aching, I'm feeling pretty sore. That's what we want to hear, Tom. Tom was making insane progress. Not only was he getting stronger, muscle was also starting to show through. And while he was smashing his training, there was also the other fact that we had to consider, the diet. Tumble specified he wanted to lose weight and get less chubby, so I wanted to put him on the most brutal, intense diet possible, counting every calorie in every single macro, with no days off and no cheat meals whatsoever. I'm, I'm joking by the way. You see, Tom's only 14 years old. The last thing I want to do is get him on a super strict diet where he's tracking all his macros, calories, he's stressing about it. I just think for his age that isn't healthy. However, that doesn't mean we can't do something with his diet, we, we definitely can. You see, at the start of the transformation, Tom was 6 foot 3, weighing 13 stone 8, which is 86 kilos. According to the National Health Service, that is technically classed as overweight. So Tom really wanted to do something about this. What we both agreed on was for him to just start eating healthier, swap out all the sugary, salty foods, and swap them for more healthy, high protein, complex carbs alternatives. Let's say he wants a snack. Instead of digging into a pack of crisps, he should have an apple instead. Just small changes like like this and in general just eating healthier this should be perfect I, I didn't enjoy cutting down on junk and food and all that, but I think it does have a positive mental effect on you. The weeks went on and Tomball was sticking to his workout program. He never missed a session. His weight was going down. His strength was increasing. He was just looking so much better physically. And he also stuck to the diet so well. You have to go back from school. This wonderful woman has made me uh, peas, rice and salmon. So you got the protein, you got the nutrients, you got the complex carbs. So uh, it's going to be a good meal. By day 30, we decided to see how Tom was doing, and the results just spoke for themselves. He'd lost fat and put on a really good amount of muscle. Oh, and his bench press max had increased by 15 kilos. Tom was proud, but he wasn't satisfied. You see, by the end of the 30 days, Tom went from 13 stone 8 or 86 kilograms to 13 stone 3 or 83 kilograms. He'd, he'd basically lost 3 kilograms of weight, which was insane, and it was so good of him. However, on the BMI, he was still classed as overweight. The goal for the 60 days was to get into the healthy weight range. Okay, day 30, 60, you ready to do this? I'm ready, yeah, let's do this. kept Tom's workout program the same. He was still making great progress in both strength and size, so there was no need to change anything. Just finished 
school, heading over to Joe's for a workout. Cromwell is currently working out and I noticed He's getting stretch marks in the arm. Can you see that? Yeah. This is proof Tom is gaining muscle. By about day 45, I could vividly see how good Tom was looking in clothes. He was getting bigger, but in a good way, because he was still losing weight. He was just looking more muscly. I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. I don't want to create false expectations. During the 60 days, Tom did plateau a bit. His strength wasn't rising as fast, but this was all completely normal. Uh, you know, I've had a couple blips. Progressive overload hasn't been perfect, but I feel like I'm making progress, and I feel like that, I'm- That's the main thing. The days went on, and as much as I thought Tom would crack, he didn't. His weight was gradually going down, and his strength was still going up. Day 30, I was here. I'm right now, I'm here. But was Tom still sticking to his diet? I'll let my mum answer that. Well, he stopped completely eating any kind of junk. He's been so good. So yeah, I think he's sticking to it pretty well. Do you want a nice big can of Pringles? That is what we like to see. What? Can you do a pull up now, I think? No. Are you serious? Yeah, can I film it? Let's see. Tom could never do a single pull-up. He always had to use resistance bands to help him. After 55 days of training it, could he finally get this? Alright, Tom, let's go. Go. Come on. Come on, yes! Come on, Tom! Oh! That is so close! Could he complete this pull-up by day 60? This was added to the goals. But enough talking. Let's finish off this 60 days. results were just insane. In fact, here was our genuine reaction after Tom took his shirt off on day 60. Oh my. Uh, it's just <laughs> huge. His chest is being fine. He looks insane. But what about his weight? Okay, you ready for this, Tom? Yeah. Here go. Oh my god. 12 stone 12, or 81.6 kilos. He was now classed as a healthy weight. Let's go. Oh. What are we on? <laughs> uh, uh. Next is strength. Did it improve? On day one, his one rep max was 50 kilos. This was day 60. Come on! His bench had gone up by a whopping 20 kilos in just 60 days. So, so yeah, I think we can check that goal off. But what about the pull-up? Could he do it? On day one, you couldn't do a single pull-up. No, I couldn't. Don't know if I can now, but you know. Day 60, Tom is attempting his first non-assisted pull-up. I don't know if this was in the first video, but I did try this on 30 days. Yeah, I couldn't get it. He couldn't up. do this on day 30 either. You ready for this? I'm ready. I'm Come ready. on, Tom. Yeah, go. Up, up, Come on! Up, 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 Come on! Up, up. Oh! He didn't get it. So that is the goal for the 100 days. Uh, we are at the end of day 60. Yeah, yeah. Overall, how are you feeling? I'm feeling pretty good, you know? I, I could have done a bit better, could have done a lot worse. I feel like I've put in a decent amount of effort and I've gotten a decent amount out. Can we just appreciate how much, like, just in general, jawline, muscles, yeah. haircut, everything from where he is now compared to day one tom is a new man oh, ladies shit. watch out cheers for watching guys and tom oh see you in over. see you in 100 days see you in 100 days thanks for watching the video if you enjoyed i'd really appreciate it if you could hit the like button and maybe also consider subscribing and lastly if you want to get any supplements like protein powder creatine pre-workout head over to my protein which is the first link in the description use my code joe at checkout which will save you 37 percent off your entire order not only is it the cheapest way to get supplements but it also helps me out a ton cheers guys